Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel Seafarer Life. I hope all of you are doing well. I am back with new video. Today I will solve the question paper of MET June 2023. If you have not subscribed my channel, then subscribe and share with your friends. So the first question is 3 register of value 2 ohm, 4 ohm and 8 ohm are connected in series across a supply of 42 volt. Find the current taken from supply and voltage drop across each register. First of all, we will write given and what we have to find. So given is R1 is equal to 2 ohm, R2 4 ohm, R3 8 and voltage is 42 volt. And we have to find the current and V1, V2 and V3. I have drawn a simple sketch in which three resistances are connected in series and connected across potential difference of 42 volt. So R equivalent is equal to R1 plus R2 plus R3. So from here we will get R equivalent is equal to 14 ohm. Then current is equal to I is equal to V divided by R. Then I will be 3 ampere. This is our first answer. Now V1 is equal to I1 into R1, V2 is equal to I2 into R2 and V3 is equal to I into R3. Then we will get our V1, V2 and V3. This is very simple and this will be our second answer. Moving to question number 2. A 4 pole 32 conductor lap on DC shunt generator with terminal voltage of 200 volt delivering 12 ampere to the load has armature resistance is equal to 2 ohm and field circuit resistance of 200 ohm. It is driven at 1000 rpm. Calculate the flux per pole in the machine. And the second part of the question is if the machine has to be run as motor with the same terminal voltage and drawing 5 ampere from mains maintaining the same magnetic field find the speed of the machine ok so first of all we will write what is given in the question and what we have to find given is pole is equal to number of pole is equal to 4 and it will be A also because it is lap on so P is equal to 4 is equal to A Z is equal to 32 voltage is equal to 200 volt IL load current is 12 ampere RA resistance R armature resistance is 2 ohm shunt resistance RSH is equal to 200 ohm N is 1000 rpm we have to find here flux and then speed if machine run as motor and drawing 5 ampere from mains ok so ISH we can get from this formula V divided by RSH V we have 200 volt and RSH is 200 so field current is 1 ampere now we can get armature current which will be sum of field resistance plus load current so 12 ampere plus 1 ampere will be 13 ampere now generated EMF we know that E is equal to V plus IA into RA we have all the value of V, IA and RA we will put in this equation and we will get generated EMF is equal to 226 volt now we have generated EMF and we know that generated EMF is equal to P phi nz divided by 60a so from here we can get phi phi is equal to e into 60 into a divided by p n z we will put value of all these terms and after calculating we will get 0 0.423 well this will be our first answer now the second part of the question when machine run as motor okay and it is 
drawing current of 5 ampere so IL will be our 5 ampere and ISH armature armature current will be same 1 ampere because everything is same here but armature current will be IL minus ISH because now machine is running as motor so armature resistance will be 5 minus 1 it will be 4 ampere then we will calculate back EMF back EMF is equal to EB is equal to V minus IA into RA from here we will get back EMF is equal to 192 volt as magnetic field is same so we know E by EB is equal to N1 by N2 we will put the value of N1 EB and E and we will simply get N2 so N2 is 849.56 rpm you can write 850 rpm also okay moving to the next question question number three a circuit has a resistance of 3 ohm and an inductance of 0 0.01 henry the voltage across its ends is 60 volt and the frequency is 50 hertz calculate the impedance the power factor and the power observed again we will write given and what we have to find i have drawn a simple sketch here 3 ohm is connected in series with 0 0.01 henry and connected across potential difference of 60 volt so what is given in the question is r is equal to 3 ohm l is equal to 0 0.01 henry voltage is equal to 60 volt frequency is 50 hertz and we have to find z impedance power factor cos phi and power absorbed means p okay so we know that xl inductive reactance is equal to 2 pi fl then we will get inductive reactance xl is equal to 3.14 ohm we have one formula for impedance z is equal to r2 plus r2 square plus xl square under root so z is equal to after putting all this value of r and xl we will get z is equal to 4.34 ohm and it will be our first answer now the second one we know that power factor is the ratio of resistance and impedance so resistance is 3 and impedance is 4.34 and it will be 0 0.69 0 0.69 it will be our cost factor now power absorb is p is equal to i square r but we don't have i so we will cal we will uh, calculate first i i will be v divided by z then i is equal to 60 divided by 4.34 I is equal to 13.82 ampere we will put this i and r value in this equation we will get p is equal to 13.82 square into 3 so the answer is 572.9 watt it will be our answer now the last question question number four a one turn armature coil ha has an axial length of 0 0.4 meter and a diameter of 0 0.2 meter it is rotated at a speed of 500 rpm in a field of uniform flux density of 1.2 tesla calculate the magnitude of the emf induced in the coil again we will write what given and what we have to find given is length of the conductor l is equal to 0 0.4 meter diameter is 0 0.2 meter n our rpm is 500 rpm and magnetic flux is 1.2 tesla we have to find emf so first of all circumference is equal to 2 pi r simply we can write it as pi d then we will get circumference 0 0.63 meter okay now we have n which is 500 rpm means 500 revolution in one minute so what will be in one second so simply we will divide 500 divided by 60 so 
दिस इज आवर रिवोल्यूशन इन वन सेकेंड नाउ इन वन सेकेंड क्वाइल साइड ट्रेवल्स हाउ मच वन सेकेंड रिवोल्यूशन इन टू दिस सरकम फेरेंस सो फाइव हंड्रेड डिवाइडेड बाई सिक्सटी इन टू पॉइंट सिक्स थ्री वी विल गेट वेलोसिटी इज्कल टू फाइव पॉइंट टू फाइव मीटर पर सेकेंड नाउ वी हैव फॉर्मूला ई एम एफ जनरेटेड ई एम एफ इज इक्वल टू बी इन टू एल इन टू फी वी विल पुट द वैल्यू ऑफ बी एल एंड फी एंड वी विल गेट वोल्टेज इज इक्वल टू फाइव पॉइंट जीरो फोर बोल्ट ओके गाइज थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग प्लीज शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल एंड कीप सपोर्टिंग